Okay, so hello, hello everyone. Good afternoon, MXI students and MXI teachers. Hi, it's so nice to see everyone here. Welcome. All right, so for this afternoon, we're gonna have our simulation for our very first virtual proctored exam. Okay, so powered by Zoom. Also, we're gonna use Schoology, Edmodo, and exam.net. Okay, but before we start, again, for all the, the teachers, I want you to change your name to your English name, so for the teachers. And then um, for the students, I want you to change your name to your English name and your grade level. So for example, if you're in grade 6A, so Mitchell Africa, grade 6A, okay? So this is for the uh, exam supervisor and the invigilator to know, okay, where you are supposed to be. Because later on, I will be putting you to your exam room, okay? So this simulation is for us to practice, to, for you to know what are you going to do for our very first virtual proctored exam or for the MYP and VPE assessment. So I believe your advisors already sent you the, um, the uh, sh uh, short tutorial video, okay? Thank you to our teachers, very, uh, very talented teachers. And uh, also the, uh, um, the uh, guidelines for taking online exams, okay? So, uh, by the way, I'm Teacher Mitchell again for, uh, um, again, welcome everyone. Before we start, okay, so for those who are, for those who are using or you will be using Edmodo, okay, you can key in the code. This is just a uh, sample class, okay, sample class so that you can take the exam. There's a sample exam also that you will be doing. So for the Edmodo code, it's UHZPPY. Okay, U H Z P P Y. And for those who are using Schoology, it's G seven J C H six P eight thirty two C K R. Okay, so I sent a message a while ago. Okay, kindly kindly check the message. I sent it. Now, okay. So what are the guidelines first for our uh, for taking the online exam? Okay. So students, you guys, okay you will be using devices to take the online exam, okay? Now, as we move along with our um, simulation, if you have any questions, or if your parents have any questions, feel free to ask questions, just message in the group chat, okay? Again, everyone, welcome to our uh, virtual proctored exam simulation. Okay, so according to teacher Denise, for today, grade 11 will be using exam.net, okay? So grade 11, make sure the, uh, teacher Denise will be sending the link later. You will be using exam.net for your practice test, okay? So don't worry, this is not graded. It will not appear in your grade. This is just a simulation so that if there will be, there will be, uh, if there will be problems, okay, we can address it right away, okay? So, as students, you will be using two devices to take the online exam, okay? You need, you need one device where you will be taking the exam. So preferably it's a, yeah, a desktop or a laptop. Now, teacher, can I use iPad? Yes, you can use iPad for taking the exam, okay? As long as you have the app that you will be using. So one device will be for taking the exam and the other device for video capture, okay? Now, make sure, students, okay, make sure that you follow the time and the date scheduled, okay? So if you're scheduled uh, Tuesday, 10 o'clock a.m., be on time. Please be there at least 15 minutes, 30 minutes before it, it, it will be better so that you can set up everything right away. Okay, so our time is set in China Standard Time. Okay, I believe there are some students right now that are not here in uh, Shaman. They might be in another country, another time zone. Please be mindful of the date and the schedule. All right. Now, 
students, again, should be online at least 15 minutes before the exam schedule. Again, eight, 30 minutes before, it's better, okay? 15 minutes is uh, at least 15 minutes before your time. So if your time is 10 o'clock a.m., be in Zoom 945, okay? So that we can set up everything because later on you will be moving to your testing room together with your uh, invigilators or your advisors, okay? Now, students should check their schedule before the examination week. So I believe your advisors already sent you the exam schedule. And students should, I suggest, to make a timetable, okay? So for example, your, uh, your exam is um, science and then math, okay? So you write the exam schedule and you write your, you write your code also, okay? So later, I will be sending the codes to your advisors what will be the code that you will be using? How about another teacher? What do you mean? Okay, there's a question. How about another teacher? Um, later, I will be moving you to your breakout room or to your testing room. So mm -hmm. we will not be here. I, I, I'm uh, very uh, overwhelmed that a lot of students are here right now. But later, you will be together with your... Um, invigilators and your classmates. Yes, is there a question? Okay, so there's a question. Can teacher Michelle? Yes, okay, so it's for teacher Denise, I will be putting teacher Michelle together with you, okay? All right, so make sure that you have your Zoom code once I sent it to your advisors. You can ask them also of what their Zoom code is and what the password is. Okay, so again, for those students who just arrived, I want you to change your name to your English name and then your um, grade level, okay? So students will be using Edmodo, Schoology, or Exam.net, and some will be doing paper-based tests, okay? So uh, some students, or some classes, so you have to ask your class uh, or your subject teachers, what is the primary platform that you will be using for the exam. Okay, so will it be Edmodo? So for my science classes, it will be Edmodo. Okay, so for some classes, it will be Schoology. And for some classes, it will be exam.net. And for some, it will be paper-based test. Okay, so you have to ask your teachers of what via platform, what are you going to use for your exam? Okay, now, for example, you're taking the science test. Once you log in to your, uh, once you, you are in um, Edmodo, or so, sorry, when, once you're in Zoom, okay, make sure that you are logged in to your exam platform. So for example, I am using, uh, um, for science, you are using, you will be using Edmodo, make sure that you're logged in to your subject teachers, to your subject teachers class, okay? So for my Edmo, for my science, okay, you have to be logged into your Edmodo. For your Schoology, you have to be logged into your Schoology. For exam.net, you have to be logged into your exam.net, okay? So your subject teachers will be giving that instructions to you, okay? If you're having any problems with logging in or signing up in your Schoology, in your Edmodo, or in your um, exam.net, kindly ask your subject teachers. I will be uh, sending um, images as well. I, I will be sending the guidelines, the steps on how can you log in or sign up for Edmodo and Schoology. And then for exam.net, kindly please ask teacher Denise, um, how, are, how, this will, how are you going to do the exam.net, okay? All right, okay, now, Students should use Zoom for web viewing. So everyone, all the students should use the video, uh, uh, should, should open their video all throughout the exam. So what I want you to do now is to click your screen again and then open your video. So all of the students should open their video or videos during the exam, all right? So again, 
what I want you to do, everyone, you should open your videos. All right. Oh, hi, Jaden. Your hair is so long now. <laughs> okay. So students should use Zoom for web viewing and should open um, and should use the Zoom code and password given by the teacher. And you should set the camera behind you. Make sure that device's screen for taking the exam is not covered. This is how you should uh, place your camera. So it should be at the back, right? At your back and your screen, as you can see, my screen, it's all in here. You can see what I am doing, all right? So what I want everyone to do is to open your video, your camera, okay? I will see it here. Okay, wow. All right, so open your video camera. So for now, it's okay if it's not placed at the back, but tomorrow, or during your exam, it should be placed at your back like this. Okay, can you see? All right, so it should be like this. So not facing, it should not be facing like this, not the front, but rather it should, you should see the, uh, you should, the, the teacher should see the screen. So you know what I am doing here, all right? So this is how our proctored exam will be implemented or will be delivered, okay? So sh you should set the camera behind you, make sure that the device is screen. So if you're using iPad for taking the exam, like this. If you're using phone for taking the exam, but I don't suggest your phone because it's hard, okay? It sh I, should see the, I should see the screen, okay? If you're using laptop, I should see the screen. If you're using uh, the desktop, I should see your screen, all right? So again, for everyone, your camera should be placed at the back, okay? So you can see clearly the screens here, or if you're using your phone, all right? But again, I don't suggest the phone. It's hard for you to take the exam. I suggest iPad, okay, or laptop, or desktop, all right? Okay, so that's how you are going to take the exam. Now, how are we going to proceed with the exam, okay? This is your main session room. I will be your exam supervisor. You will be going in, okay, the main session room, and make sure, again, that your name is your English name and your grade level. If during the exam, your names are not in English name and without grade level, I, grade levels, I might not be able to put you in the correct room because later I will be moving you to the rooms, okay, to, the, to your rooms with your invigilators, okay? So your video and audio should be on. So I want, later I will be turning all the audios make sure that your audio while taking the exam is turned on. If not, your invigilators will tell you to turn on your audios, okay? Now, later, you will be receiving a prompt, okay? Later, you will be receiving a prompt to join a breakout room. The breakout room is your Your breakout room is your uh, testing room, okay? Um, you, and then once you're settled there, your invigilators will tell you to, your invigilators will tell you to, uh, start, you, that you can start the exam already, okay? So again, make sure that you are there in, uh, you are here in the main session room 15 minutes before the time, okay? Now, reminders, kindly make sure that you have a stable internet connection, okay? Um, 4G can be used, but I suggest Wi-Fi or LAN connection. It is uh, preferred, 
okay? But if you're using 4G, if your 4G is strong, it's fine, okay? As long as you have good internet connection. Now, again, you have to log in to your Edmodo, to your Schoology, or to your exam.net before the time. So if your time is 10 o'clock, 9.45, be in Zoom, again, the, uh, the uh, setup should be like this, all right, at the back, okay? The screen should be seen. And then you have to log into your, you have to log into your Edmodo or Schoology or exam.net, okay? So again, it will be from your teacher, subject teachers. Um, in case there's a problem with your Edmodo or Schoology, kindly refresh, okay? And then you can resume with your exam. Now, if you have any questions regarding the exam, if you have any questions with uh, some technical difficulties, inform your, inform your uh, invigilator right away or your advisor, okay? Inform your invigilator or your advisor. If Zoom is not working, then message in, uh, in, the, uh, in WeChat, okay? So kindly message right away. Because if you're not in Zoom, okay, for 10 minutes, your exam will be nullified and um, you have to discuss it with your proctor, or with your invigilator or with your subject teacher, okay? All right. So again, exam questions will be delivered through Edmodo, Schoology, or exam.net. And you can only take the exam once again. So if there will be problems, you can message your invigilator, your supervisor, through WeChat or through Zoom. And if you have any problems logging in or signing up through your Zoom, uh, Schoology or Edmodo, you can message me or you can message teacher Denise for um, exam.net, okay? Now, yes, so that's how we are going to take the exam. Or that's what, uh, that, those are the things that you need to remember uh, when you take the exam, okay? So these are the things. Turn on your video and audio throughout the exam. Log in your, to your subject key assessment platform. Make sure you have a stable internet connection. You are not allowed to go to the bathroom or anywhere while taking the exam. So make sure, so make sure that, so make sure that uh, you go to the bathroom, you eat your breakfast or your lunch before you take the exam. Remove any review materials, okay? So again, this will be the setup. This will be the setup and remove any review materials. If your subject teacher allowed you to, especially for math, if your subject teacher allowed you to use papers, then you can use papers, okay? But if your subject teacher didn't allow you, then you cannot use your, um, your what is that, your paper, okay? So for the teachers, if you have some uh, um, important, important, um, reminders for the students you can message here in our group chat, okay? Teacher, I have a question. Okay, so there is a question, yes. Yes, so what if we can't properly set up so that it's like behind us, the camera is behind us? Can we do it like beside us or something? Because, Sorry, what, there is a... Um, okay, what if we can't find a proper setup to put it behind us. Could oh, okay. We... So, all right. So, yeah, if yeah. you don't have, like, if, for example, you don't have a tripod or uh, you can just, you know, just put it at your back. Okay. You can put like books, file, file your books, and then put your camera there. It's a, you don't really need to, um, you don't really need a tripod for this. So, or get a chair and then, or a table, and then put it on your back, and then place it there. Now, I do know that you have your parents with you, or your brothers or sisters, you can borrow up to their phones, or maybe your parents can, you know, assist you to, so that you have two devices. So just make sure that you have your laptop or your uh, iPad with you, and then your camera at your back, right? That, that's a nice question. Thank you so much, uh, Shayona. Thank you. And then, yes. Okay. Now, if if um, make sure also you are taking the exam, so make sure you are in a quiet and comfortable area of your house. 
And if any problems arise, again, message your invigilator or advisor using Zoom or WeChat. Now, again, um, for our trial today, okay, so for if you're um, using Edmodo, okay, you can practice with Edmodo, you can practice using Schoology, or you can practice using exam.net, okay? Um, I will be showing you the uh, exam that, um, oh, sorry, the Edmodo screen and also the Schoology screen so that you can practice your test or how are you going to take the test and um, also later with teacher Denise, the exam.net, okay? I will be assigning you to your rooms, but before I assign you to your rooms, okay, so this is, um, this is how you're going to take your um, exam using Edmodo, all right? So as you can see in my screen, okay, so this is your Edmodo, and then during your time, okay, so the, uh, the exam will be shown here, okay, it will pop up here. So this is a sample test, you just have to click it and then take the exam. Right, so uh, make sure that you have your class code and then you can take the test. Okay, so this is just a sample test. If you if you join UHZPPY, okay, so this is a sample test so that you know how to take the test using Edmodo. Okay, make sure, okay, uh, students read the instructions before taking the test. Again, read the instructions before taking the test. All right, so there is a, there is a question. Okay, let's wait for a while. All right, so here, if you're using Schoology, okay, you can go to this access code and you can practice a sample test here. You just click it and then again, read the instructions before taking the exam, okay? So for example, hello students, welcome to your biology e assessment. And there are some reminders from your teachers, okay? So kindly read the questions carefully, Choose the best answer in ticket. Be mindful of the time limit. And uh, you might have randomly selected questions. And again, if the browser stops, refresh and click resume. And if you have any questions, do not ask your classmate and your invigilator will attend to your needs. And then you can click the attempt, all right? So if you're taking the test, uh, here, so again, in Edmodo, you just click this. So if the test is not yet out during your uh, scheduled time, then uh, refresh it. And if it's not yet there, kindly message your, sub your invigilator or your subject teacher, okay? So this is a sample test. If it's a multiple choice question, so just click. Okay, the correct answer and then next page, right? So this is just a sample. You can go to the uh, class code that I sent for Edmodo and Schoology and you can practice the test when I put you to your breakout rooms, okay? So, okay, so there's a, all right. So uh, right now I will be putting you to your breakout rooms together with your teachers, I will be putting the teachers first and then the students, okay? So again, I will be putting you to your breakout rooms. You will get a prompt, you will receive a prompt in your Schoology, uh, sorry, in your Zoom. You will receive a prompt in your Zoom and then um, you just have to accept it. You will be going to the breakout rooms together with your teachers, okay? All right, so all the rooms are open now. You will see a prompt. Just click it, and then you will be moved to your rooms. So kindly check. You will be moving to your rooms for grade six, grade eight, grade nine, 
So make sure that your names are your English name and your grade level. Again, you will receive a prompt and you will see your invigilators there. Okay, so right now the students and the teachers, the invigilators are in their respective rooms. So I will be visiting them. I will be checking them one by one to see like how it goes uh, in every room, right? All right, so this will be your exam room. Again, make sure that your, your, um, the, uh, the uh, camera is at your back. Okay, so you will see your invigilator here. Yeah, I'll do so it later. Can, okay, and then you have your Edmodo code and your Schoology code. You can try it out and try the sample test. Okay. So you will, here you will see your invigilator, okay? You will meet your- Wait, teacher, where- Okay. Yes, what's the question? I uh, know. So we have to use Schoology if we have, or Edmodo? It depends on the teacher. So for example, if your but science you teacher told you that you will be using Schoology for the test, then you will be using Schoology during the test. If your okay. teacher told you using Edmodo, then you can use Edmodo. Make sure that your camera is open. Everyone, students, make sure that your camera is open. Okay. So, and it's placed at your back and then the screen should be seen. Okay. Again, make sure that the screen is at your back, and then you can see the. It should be like this. Okay. It should be like. Oh, sorry. Okay. It should be like this. Can you see sample student grade 6A? Okay, so that should be at, the, at your back and then it should be seen. There are non-video participants, everyone. Okay, you should open your video. It should be at the back then your screen should be seen. Okay, can I see that? Okay, can I check it? Yeah, like that. Like, can you see Giacomo? Okay, like, like, uh, who's that? Cam said, yes, Cam. Hi, hi Cam, how are you? Okay, Cam. Yeah, uh, okay. Like Giacomo, okay, Giacomo screen, like that, okay? So Warren, uh, Ashvin, Tom, Jane, I need Schoology on my Okay, um, so check your, teacher. yeah, check your Schoology and check your. Teacher, um, yes. my iPad broke a couple of days ago and I only, I only can use my phone as of now. Use your, so, use your phone. Um, my phone the is camera? far away and there's no zoom on my phone. Use your I iPad. Download Schoology. So I need okay, to so use my computer, but, but I can't download Schoology on my computer. So now I'm really so go, annoyed. So search it. Yeah, I'm trying. It won't load. Okay. All right, so hello, grade nine. Make sure that, okay, make sure that your videos are on, okay? So everyone, your videos are closed. Again, make sure that your videos are on. I want to see all your videos. Okay, so I want to see all your videos turned on, okay? How are you going to place your video camera? Okay, so your video camera should be placed at your back. 
All right. Um, Teacher, can I put it at my side? Because I don't have side. anything for it to stand. As long as, as long as I can see your screen, okay, as long okay. as I can see your screen, it's fine. Okay. Okay. So your teacher, I'll just put anywhere because I don't have the thing to stand in my phone. Stand my phone. Yeah. Now. Yeah, but I should see your screen. Okay, so I should see your screen. It's not okay. So I should see you and your screen. Okay, that's what's important. Uh, okay, it should be like this. Okay, it should be. It should be like this. Should be like this. Okay, can you see the sample student? Yes. Okay, if you see the sample student, that should be your uh, camera. Okay, everyone, you should turn on your screen while you're taking the test. Teacher. Okay, for Schoology, the code is. Okay, for Schoology, it's G7JC. Okay, so Schoology is Schoology. G. Show them the exam.net. Okay, so that's how exam. to how to submit their answer. Yes. Okay. So make guys make sure that your videos are turned on again, and then your invigilator can see your screen. Oh wow. Okay. So you're going to oh, yeah, use exam.net. Yes, Miranda. Teacher Mitchell. Yeah. I can't hi, put it man. at the back. Like there's nothing behind me. <laughs> No, um, you can what, table or anything, chair, and then you can just put place your camera like Can I this. place it at like sideways? You can still you, see the screen. You, yes, as mm. long as you can see the screen, and you can we can okay. see we can see you in the screen. That's it. Okay. Okay. Teacher, teacher, yes. can I actually try now? Like yeah, yeah. Yes. try now. Turn on your right. camera. Yes. Okay. I'll, I'll actually try now so like you don't know, got like like the teachers don't like really think I'm cheating cuz I'm not gonna <laughs> cheat but like you know just I'm just afraid cuz like all the teachers are are going to just like stare at me you know that's kind of scary like someone is like looking at behind you like like just staring at you it's kind of scary <laughs> just to make sure you know I'm just gonna try now Yes, yes, okay? That's why we have the simulation. So please, everyone, turn on your videos and audio. And then, yeah. And please, I, uh, yes. Because sometimes you can hear the other rooms. Okay, a while ago, we're in grade nine, and then we can hear teacher Denise. So keep quiet, all right? <laughs> okay, okay, wait. If you have questions, just message in the chat box, okay? I'll turn like, on your camera. I'm yeah, gonna everyone. like put it like this, right? So, you know, actually, I was trying a lot yesterday because I don't know how should I make it to stand. I, I, Rachel, I think you should put it landscape, Rachel. 
This is fine. I'll I'll sit here. Like this is fine, okay? Closer. Like a, li a little closer. And then you have to a bit closer. Oh, Wait. Because the camera looks really far, but then it's really close already. Like this. Is this fine? Teacher? Yeah. Is this one fine? Like, for example, like this? <laughs> Is this one fine? The position of your camera. Yeah. Huh? Make it landscape. What do you mean landscape? Like uh, tilt your phone to like you're watching a video. I have Gulo, nakapokus sila sa test. Ko. Ko. Yes, yes po. I think I need I need to have the link for exam.net para ma-monitor ko yung ginagawa ng mga bata. Ah, okay po. Ay, ah, okay. A, a teacher could upload the link to exam.net and share me the uh, include message. Ah. Because they are also okay. uh, no, they have they are also monitoring the classes. Yeah. Yes, yes, po. Uh, sa isa send sa yon. Uh, sa sabing ko, iya ano kung ayon. To send. Okay, send. Yes, po. Ah, I school logic I cannot. For school logic I cannot monitor. It independent ng school logic hindi siya live. Ah, uh, uh, okay, po. Okay, Hi, Ray. Bye. Hi, Ray. One minute. Uh, and I am going to click for submission whether you're fi you finished or not. Whether you're done with the test or not. So I'm going for submission to save or do screenshot. Now, okay, so I'm going at this. It's already 3.20, so it's going to be for submission. Okay. Okay I'll, uh, okay, I'll just go to grade 8A. All right, I'll be back. Thank you, teacher Denise. Hello, grade eight. Wow. <laughs> Hello, grade eight. How are you here? How's everyone here? Uh, guys, kindly turn on your video. Everyone, kindly turn on your videos. And if you would please, at your back, I should see the screen. All right. So during the exam, your audio and your video should be turned on. Again. All right, so I can see Darren. Oh, Darren, where are you? Oh, Leonardo. Wait. Oh, he is so handsome, huh? Right. 
Hi. So handsome. Okay, so when you're taking the exam, all right, just like, just like, who's that? Milab, yes, okay, just like Milab. So the uh, video should be at the back, or sorry, the, the camera should be at the back, and then it should see your screen. So that's how you're going to take the test. You need to ask your teachers if you're going to or if you're going to use Edmodo or you're going to use paper-based or paper-based tests. Okay. The, um, here, okay, just like uh, just like the setup of Nilab, okay, at the back, so we should see your screen. Now, grade eight for your science and your design, it's uh, your test. All right, so again, good afternoon, everyone, and welcome back to the main session room. Now, at this point, what we will be doing is I will be giving time to your teachers to give some uh, final um, reminders for their students, okay? So for the teachers who wanted to, to talk or to discuss, okay, like for example, teacher Jane, um, I'll give you time to discuss it now. So just message in the group chat whoever teacher wanted to uh, discuss something to their students. Uh, WeChat Uh,那另外呢,嗯,因为你们的这个手机是用来开Zoom,要来,啊,投放你们答卷的这个情况的。那所以你们试卷传输的时候就不能通过手机的这个WeChat,而必须你们在电脑上要有一个,啊,微信